I think that psychology is an extremely important part of being able to do mathematics. In fact, I spend a lot of time with my PhD students, um, not talking about mathematics, but giving them the confidence that they can tackle those unsolved problems of mathematics that I'm setting them. So I think that's absolutely key when you're faced with an exam question or absolutely stuck and you don't know what to do, is trying to rebuild your confidence somehow um, when sometimes you think, I can't do this, because you can, You've got all the tools at your fingertips to be able to answer that question. So your confidence is going to be hit uh, many times during the course of an exam when you can't do something. Um, but you've got to believe that answer is there, you have the tools, and once you have rebuilt your confidence, um, suddenly everything, I hope, will become uh, crystal clear for you. Doing mathematics is a little bit like playing chess, where you have to look several moves in advance to be able to find your way to the final solution. So remember that an exam question um, might look very confusing at first sight, but what you've got to do is to break it down into small pieces, um, a bit like thinking about each of those chess moves, so you can find your way from um, the things that you know to the answer that you're trying to find at the end.